Hello, universe! And, universe, and we are Dr. beautiful! Today we are going to be I'm doing all of the above. Yes, 3, 7, 12. I almost jumped off the map there. Can I do that? I'm gonna try that now. Now I wanna know! <laughs> Today we're doing the gem cups. Um, I'm not going to be using this Cort ugly Cortex skin, presumably, because I'm going to let Mayo choose uh, all the skins that I get to use. Or not skins, but like characters and stuff like yeah. that. Um, I don't know if I have Grand... You know, I'll check before we go into the gem cups if I have any Grand Prix stuff, because you do get a little bit of an offline boost from it. Yep, and it, if you're watching this in the future, we're in the middle of the Twilight Tour Grand Prix. Yes, sir. Which you should have figured that out from the last video, but if you didn't, now you're up to speed. I don't think I can. I don't even know how I jumped that high. I'll try it one more time. All right, but yeah, the I feel like the there's five cups again. So, uh, All right, so yeah, we're going there. I'm gonna let you choose which character I get to play. Will we make our way over there? Unless you already have it in mind. our way downtown. Also, just so everyone knows, until the gr current Grand Prix is over, we will be alternating between Adventure Mode and Grand Prix until then. Yep. So, just a heads up. At least unless things change, we might decide if we're really trying to complete this, we might need to blitz the Grand Prix. But Yeah, but we'll have to, uh, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. I might Part of just... it too is that I don't actually think that the main game is going to take that long in terms of parts. Yeah. Like, after this is just the relics, and then we got the time trials, and that's basically it. And plus, honestly, a lot of the Grand Prix stuff I might just do off, like, off camera if it's in terms of, like, actual races online and stuff like that. Especially Normally, if I would be hesitant about that because of chain memories, but... But Grand Prix I is all like, out here because uh, we don't really have a choice. Or, or maybe we'll live stream it. We'll we'll figure it out when the time comes. I would be okay with live streams. Yeah, we'll we'll figure it out when the time comes. We might do that. Um. So yeah, we're doing the gem cups. So we're gonna start from red to green to blue to yellow to purple. So this is the correct order. So which character should I play? Let's go Crash. Crash. Do I have Grandpa Crash? I have Grandpa Crash, right? Yep. Yeah, I want to say you do. Okay, I'm using Grandpa Crash. <laughs> Eeyaw! I love the young people. Biker Crash is in the game, and I want him. Oh, okay, we do have this. So is he oh, in the game now? I'm so what? sick and tired of using this fucking buggy. Oh, but I'm, I'll use it. I bet, but we need all of it we can get. Yeah. Also, use the paint, too, because we need it. Uh, and where's my Penta sticker? There he is. I'm not changing There's... these wheels, though. That's not changing. <laughs> Even though you get a 5% boost out of it. Yeah. Oh well. I absolutely refuse. I spent my hard earned money. Oh, we didn't change it at th Oh, well, too late. <laughs> I oh, just realized wait. that you were going to change it at 30 FPS. Oh, shoot. Uh, whatever. Next part. Remind me next part. Um, though I Here, have seen I'll other. Make... I've seen other videos on Nitro Kart, and all of them seem to be shit quality in 480p. So I don't know if it's just me. <laughs> or rather, I don't think it's just me. <laughs> Yeah, I've noticed, I, I've seen a few other ones, and unless you're watching 720p, uh, nice or... Or above. Uh, yeah, or above, it's it's just bad looking. And I forgot, I'm on hard mode. Um, so yeah, welcome hard everyone hard mode, everybody. to hard mode. This is the only track I feel probably the least confident in potentially winning. Good thing you only have to do it once. You know, it's kind of sad when... It, this is the scariest track to me. Like this, it's this is scarier in single player than it is in uh, online for me almost. Oh no, it, it is. I 100% agree. Then again, for like you know, you'll always get that one person that's absolutely amazing at the game, but even most if they're of them really aren't that great. Yeah, even the people that are absolutely really good at this game, uh, it doesn't matter. Oh, so tiny, track. what are you doing? That was. I think that was her. No, tiny. Look at the map. Oh. Oh, was, was he going in circles? No, he's way behind. Oh, he's Tiny's, catching up. But Tiny's just crazy. But yeah, no, online, I've got it since we've uh, last recorded, and oh my god, it is he's fucking his insane. Main account. Yeah, it's, Still don't have it yet. it's insane. Although, although we're looking into possible ways to rectify that. Yes. That's a, worst comes to worst, we still have that free trial. Yeah. Although well, that's not going to get us out of all of the Grand Prix. Yeah. Of course. Uh, I kept my momentum there for like a second. 
so yeah, this is... I am not going to restart if I obviously lose a race, because it's pretty standard. Although it is the first race. Yeah, it's, this is also, you know, Crash Cove, so there's, there's that. Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah. Third place, eh, plus three. I, I think I'll be safe, because... Oh yeah, get ready to see this a lot, by the way, guys. <laughs> yep, we mentioned before, we're on Grand Prix mode. Oh, you're about to get oh. the tires. <laughs> Shame you have to swap off. I'm not swapping off the tires. I utterly refuse. Uh, we need to get those new Grand Prix tires. I uh, well, I refuse to swap them out. You cannot make me look here. No, I played... mean, like the ones that are in the pit stop that still have the effect. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe I'll grab those. Maybe we'll think. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Like, there's some variants. I haven't gotten any of them yet because, well. You know about it. I mentioned it on video because it happened fairly recently. I lost my save file and I got really unmotivated to play the game after that. Yeah, so I've heard that you actually lose all your boss characters and stuff too, which that sucks. Mm. So, I assume you, do you lose the appropriate skins too in like the hovercraft then? Well, you don't lose the hovercraft because you have the oxide edition, but... I think you do. I loaded my cloud save almost immediately, but that still wasn't the surefire save because that save was a few days behind, so I had none of my Grand Prix stuff, and I yeah, lost I, a few of my Oxide Ghosts, and it was like, uh... I thought the Grand Prix stuff was going to be a compound because the Pit Stop stuff is clearly a compound. So I figured that they were both going to be a compound, but apparently not. Oh, okay. Um... So yeah, sorry about that guys, keep cloud saving because this game still has a global data corruption bug. Apparently. And uh, just to be clear, everybody, uh, my version of the game that it happened on was 1.0 or 1.05, so it was the most recent version, unless it's updated again. I think it's still on that. But it is not fixed. <laughs> of course it isn't. Of course tit isn't. Haha, <laughs> I said tit. I mean, I would make a joke about it actually being a stable game, but then I remember all those pictures you sent me before we started the part, and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the perfect game with no plots. This this game, the the alternate title to this game is Crash Band uh, Crash Team Racing Nightmare Fueled. I actually like that title better. We have that. I hope if we ever get to do an online video, it happens. It's it's not like the rarest thing in the world, but it's not like common at the same time. It's it's a fun. It's fun. if we can get Yoga Doctor running, then sure, why not? I still have PS Plus on mine. I do too. Oh well, yeah, but presumably he would be playing on there, so. That's true. Um, I don't know. I don't know how it works. I'll have to figure it out. I'm not gonna mention it on video because I don't know if. I... Presumably, we would just have to add each other on our friend list, so... Presum oh, God! It'd be a little weird, but you do it. I don't even think they have to be on your friends list. I think they just have to well, be... Well, for a lobby. Oh, for a lobby, yeah. You Oh, you would Would you want to play? But if that's how we were doing it, then yeah. I'm so close to getting those wheels. If <laughs> anything, I'm just glad I'm going to get Tana. Because it's a character. Yep, and also guess what that would mean? Trophy girl. Lots of Tana, because you get the boost. Oh, that's true. No, no, for story mode and stuff, I'll let you choose. Maybe, oh, well, we're not going to have a lot of story mode left, but I'm still going to let you choose for the remainder of story yeah, mode. You've only got, like, th three or four parts of story mode really left. Yeah, as for... Maybe uh, four if you really stretch it. Yeah, and as for, uh, what's it called, um, as for the, the Oxide Ghosts, I'm gonna be, and conversely, the Entropy Ghosts, I'm gonna be doing those with probably Tana, presumably, because I am an XL main, so, oh, that's unfortunate. So you've, uh, come to realize how amazing acceleration characters are. Good, you can explain that when we get to time trials. I mean, I've been an XL main, I think, since I would say the beginning. I just played uh, per, uh, through my first playthrough because, you know, I, it's just normal. Okay, this isn't online. Stop it. <laughs> I mean, let's not kid ourselves. The single player is really buggy, too. It is. I'm just more, like, uh, bewildered by the fact that I got... Man, the electric effects on this is great. I'm more bewildered by the fact that I got... On the wheels, it is. That I got oh, yeah. two freaking 
blue spheres, orbs, whatever they're called. And the blue orbs of death. Oh, oh my god, I am playing online. I take everything back. I mean, that's why the. Oh my god, I am orders. playing online! <laughs> you are in seventh place. <laughs> I've never seen this hasn't happened to me like in online normally though. It's a joke by the way guys because in online mode there's blue orbs up the fucking wazoo. It's kind of absurd. All right, can I make this? Okay. Oh god, of course he shoots a <laughs> missile as soon as I get in front of him. <laughs> of course. Okay, this is the last lap. Perfect. Barely. Oh, no, God! <laughs> <laughs> Who cares? He made it. Wow, okay. I, I'm actually really glad I didn't get second. <laughs> there goes all of our, uh, what's it called? Our little challenges that we can just get normally, probably, for the time being. Also, I just want to say... Um... We mentioned this vaguely in the last part, but it's a definitely 100% confirmed. My Wumpa coin fucking thing that I spent like an entire night setting up for our spread, our Google Doc has oh, been yeah, the whole thing is officially outdated. Outdated. Granted, Should I just I, delete that at this point. Um, there's a there's a there's a thread that has the most optimal stuff on Reddit for farming and stuff like that. What I think I'll do is I'm probably just gonna edit it accordingly. Like I'm just gonna change. I'm gonna edit uh, all the the Wumpa coins to. to be the, what the correct number is right now and then but i'm gonna it's not even necessarily correct because that tab is only showing it for a set time since the, the coins are set to time now what do you mean they're set to time it's not a set number anymore like you, you would have gotten 20 for crash cove anymore but you can still get first place in crash cove and get two different numbers oh yeah well i'm gonna just mark down the first place times uh, the first place lump of coins is what I mean. Like, cause, uh, for example, Electron Avenue is the only track that gives you 80 coins still anymore, um, if you're in first. Tiny Temple, or Tiny Arena, for some reason, gives you less now. Gives you 72, I think, now in first. Um, and then, yeah, I don't know. It, it sucks it's outdated. I know the most optimal levels to farm at this current moment. Um, I think but, Tiny Temple is, like, the number one for now. Um, Thunderstruck is at this current time because there is a huge exploit. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting about the exploit, but, yeah, um, the, there is a... I'm pretty sure they actually got rid of it in the online map rotation because I have not seen it. I haven't seen it online either, which... Honestly, good, because, yeah, that was, like, two-thirds the lap. It's it's it half the race. made Oxide trivial. It's half the race, yeah. My Literally, my best time is, like, 58 seconds. Oh, because I was screwing around in time trial, then I was like, oh, wait, yeah. this is gonna this is gonna be on the leaderboards now, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, once I figured that out, I, uh, I was intentionally waiting so that I would only be, like, a couple seconds ahead of Oxide. <laughs> Booyah, Grandma! It's for beating, I think, one... Yeah, it's for one yeah. cup. Felt like checking real quick. Who did you unlock? Did you get one character for every cup? Um, I don't know. It flashes by... Oh, it might show me after this. Do I? It's just... Is it... So yeah, who do you get? Because... I know you it's, get... Wasn't it the bosses crash. in the original it game? It was the bosses in the original. That's why I'm like, are you sure? I know if you get Fate Crash for beating the Purple Gem. That yeah, that one's still the same. Yeah, I'm maybe not the rest. We'll see. It'll pop up, I think, after this loading screen. If that is the case. I also wish I had the Biker Crash skin, though. Grandpa Crash is also really good. In Biker Crash, he flings a yo-yo in front of the screen, and then it hits his nuts. That's so ridiculous, it actually sounds true. Uh, Pink Ripper. Oh, yeah, you get specific oh, yeah, boss you get skins. skins. Except for, uh, whatever, the other cup. Alright. Who do oh. I do for the next gem? Who am I, who am I playing as? Play as Jen. How about Dingo? I don't think you did Dingo yet. 
to Dingo Dial we go. Uh, I have to. I don't know how I unlock Panda, Ding Panda Dingo, but I'm using it. Panda Dingo. It's right in front of you and you still can't drive straight it's in. so hard! Games are hard. One of these days, he's gonna let me... He's gonna, he's gonna pick Pence of Penguin. We'll, we'll all... You're gonna almost exclusively use Pentas. <laughs> we're we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> hear looking. we're gonna hear the fabled Penguin Yay one line. One of these days, one of these days, I'm telling you. First character to unlock, last character to play. <laughs> I mean, if a cheat code counts as an unlock, I guess. It is an unlock. Rue with two with my favorite stage in the universe. Hey, hey! You call that racing? Crikey! It's a my dango dial. We're probably offending a lot of people, and I'm sorry about that. But we're probably gonna continue to do so. Crikey! I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> Actually, what are we talking about? After the last Kingdom Hearts video, what am I called? <laughs> Crikey! Which I'm sure hardly anybody that sees this video is going to have seen that, but uh... I'm half Dango, half like Crocodile! <laughs> they call me Dango Dial! Crikey! I play the didgeridoo! Oh no! It's getting worse! <laughs> I'm from the Outback! You know it's bad when I'm the one complaining about the stereotypes going too far. I, you, you should be complaining about that to me! I fight kangaroos every day! But do you win? Yes, as I am Crocodile! Oh. Dingo. Oh. Oh, well, that person has the, or that person, that Pura has the Puss in Boots Pura. I really like that suit. It looks nice, so of course it's exclusive to the pit stop. That's how that works. Yeah. Basically all the all the non recolors. All the really good ones. All the non recolors. Yeah. <laughs> My controller is showing as red in this only started happening, the light, this only started happening when we started recording. Maybe it's like, maybe the lie, the light is like life support in a sense, and it, and it like, when you have your hands on the controllers, it senses how how your health currently is. Maybe red <laughs> just means bad. Oh uh, no. I don't know, dude. Is that is that a little too specific? I don't know. I mean, I've never had that happen. <laughs> I only I think, have red happen when my battery's low. Even then, that's rare. I think like, it has to be really low. I think you've told me it's happened uh, when you opened Chain of Memories once, of course. I vaguely remember that, but because I remember, I, I remember it happened to me when I opened Chain of Memories, and I was, and you were like, "Huh, that happened to me this one time." So it turns out having the speedometer is pointless in this game. Yeah, but I've come to realize that too, sadly. Well, a lot of it has to do with the fact that they visually made all the stupid, like, Ultra Sacred Fire, all that dumb stuff. They made it so much easier to figure out in this game, so having mm -hmm. a speedometer is basically kind of pointless. Granted, it gives you the same information that the, the original game would give you. Oh, sure. But... It's... The game gives you more information now. Yeah. Though, part of me... I'll try to use this... this on on the LP account at least because I I don't know I just I'm so used to the speedometer it feels really weird not using it but at the same time I don't know I'm like my, my my boosts have gone to muscle memory at this point uh, though whenever I do glance at to just to be sure that I am uh, drifting yeah. properly I do look at the bottom right I almost never look at my yeah boots. it's hard to see I will say at the very least I don't know if it's just a me thing but the new gauge I can never get a perfect boost off, off of from. Uh, the the nitro fueled specific one. Uh, yeah. 
I can do it with the speedometer. I can do it with the classic one. I cannot do it with the nitro fuel. Bomb. Um, I got the as fast as. Oh yeah, there there's a daily today that's beat Coco Park, um, a certain amount of time. I'm not using those wheels. Sorry. And you can't make me. I'll use them. Maybe we can make him use them during the Twilight Tour. Yeah, uh, videos. I'll do. I'll do it during <laughs> the Twilight Tour videos. As for everything else, nah, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> and even then, as soon as he gets something better, bye bye. Um, the next wheels you get are in gold tier. Well, I mean, you can still get some from the pit shop and all that. Uh, that's true. More like the shit shop, am I right? Two hundred and ten thousand. It's actually more now, so that's not even accurate. To be fair, it's actually really not that bad, especially if you're using the Thunderstruck for the daily grind. Because they finally, even though after everybody figured it out, they finally announced how the the, the shit works, the mm -hmm. times five thing. Of course, I, am I playing online? And then they added times two on top of that. Yeah, well, that's just weekend stuff. Yeah, but still, is it, we is could it do that. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And since today's Friday, we're recording this on Friday, by the way. Yeah. No, I assume, weekend. I assume they ended on Saturday. I'm not actually sure about that, because like I said before, I have not played the game since my save got deleted. That, that was a bit of a soul crusher. Like, ah! oh, I have to do all those challenges I did again. Ah! Like... The <laughs> I apparently I am playing online. This is like the luck of online. I'm telling you. Fuck! Now the luck of online would be to be in first place for the first two laps and like ninety percent of the third lap, and then suddenly get bombarded by blue orbs and missiles. Dude, yeah, you don't understand. Every time I play online now, it takes like ten seconds. For, for a, either a blue orb to appear or for to a, cl a clock to appear. That hasn't happened to me yet. That's thanks. happened to me so many times. Not Although even, clearly you've played online more than I have. Even, even worse, you, you want to you wanna know about the worst match I ever had? I won this match, but that's mostly because everybody was... Of course that happened. I mean, because everybody was like in like the worst possible spot. So, basically, um, I started the... I yeah, I know how I jumped that. I got, um, what's it called? Um, it was Sewer Speedway. So that that's already one, one, one of the issues. Um, so it was Sewer Speedway, and what happened was there were like eight, eight, eight blue orbs like the entire race. Right? Oh. That's already insane enough as it is. I was first place like the entire time. Everyone just wasn't good mixed in, like, comparatively to me. Mixed in with the fact that, uh... What's it called? Uh, a stupid shortcut. Yeah, the, stu the stupid shortcut mixed in with just all the shit going on. So there was like, motherfucker! There was like eight <laughs> blue orbs that entire race. I'm sorry for laughing. Um, there was eight blue orbs like the entire race. Um, and there was also like six entropy clocks that were used. It was the most hectic and craziest race I, I think I've ever experienced. Like, I didn't even know what was going on. Well, that and this one Crash Cove race that I had. Of course it's Crash Cove. I mean, come on, what'd you expect? I hate how Crash Cove has a lot of missions tied to it right now, because I hate playing Crash Cove online. <laughs> I can't yeah, believe I won that. Speaking of which, of, good, good luck getting that, getting each position thing. It's easy if you have a friend. If you have seven friends. No, you can just have one. It's easy with one friend. I did it with one friend. I've done all the challenges, like, just period. Except for the dailies and the weeklies that have to reset and all that stuff. The hardest one is the one that I told you about. Which they expect you to do. You can't do it in a private lobby with friends. Online matchmaking only. Start in 8th place on the last lap and win. It is the most luck. Like, yet not only do you have to be super good, but it's completely based on luck. Like, you have to have really either really bad people in your lobby that are basically as bad as easy bots, or... You have to have the luck that I had in every other person that I know that's gotten it, which is um, let the game like sit in a lobby with like with a friend and matchmaking, and then hope to God people just start leaving and it doesn't boot you out of the lobby. 
That's how we got it. That's how I got it. That's how another uh, friend. Of, that's how all my friends have gotten it. Nobody knows. I don't. Think yeah, I believe it. I don't think it's possible to do it otherwise. It, it's so. It's like there's so much luck you need for it. I mean, for every online lobby I ever played, I ended up getting that happening within like 30 minutes tops, where it'd be whittled down from eight to three, and nobody ever joins again after that. I join. Oh, never mind. Nobody but him joins. Lost my blue flame. Crikey! I lost my blue flame, mate. I'm pretty sure. Does it? Is it CMK or is it CTR? He says crikey in one of these games. I know that. I feel like it has to be CTR because you probably wouldn't remember CMK. You barely played him. Yeah, I only played him like once. You yeah. raced against him plenty, but. Maybe he says that in both. He could. It's a possibility. I feel like it's so stereotypical that it, it, I wouldn't be too surprised. Can I keep the... Oh, uh, nope. Nope. Goodbye, world. Can I keep the blue flame? Can I? 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 No. Come on, even I can hold it longer than that. I'm not used and to. I barely touch this stage. I'm not used to advanced characters. You still seem to be doing pretty good to me. I say as you drive into a green potion. I'm not. I'm not good at that good with advanced characters. I'm. I'm only. I'm good with EXO, and I'm pretty decent with beginners. But beginner characters in general just suck. So the fact that I beat the first like part of the game with polar only kind of baffles me knowing how bad they actually feel to play in the rough long run. And Pura, uh, don't forget about that. Yeah. For, for when you're going for the tokens. Yeah, which is... Ugh. Well, that was just for Crash Cove, I think. That was for all of them. Oh. Why did I hate myself? We've done it! Crikey, mate! You can't imagine how you would have slot for every level. Seems right. like too much effort. Who do I play for next cup? Hmm. I think I swapped question. out every world, it's not every level. Yeah, I feel like you've probably covered everybody at this point. That you have. I'm pretty sure I haven't done any of the bosses ex No, I've done Pop. But you've done, done most of them Rick. over the plot. I've done. Yeah, you Pop did Ripper Roo, Ripper. you did Pop. I think the only one you might not have done is Komodo Joe. There's only. There's an easy way to find out. Oh yeah, the skins. Yeah, because you get a skin for winning with everyone. One race. Oh, fun survey! Yeah, I had fun. Oh wait, no, I, I pressed skip. Oops. Oops, sorry! <laughs> yes, I got Shrek! Somebody once told me the world! <laughs> That's all I know! Nobody knows the lyrics this time! Let's go, Romy! I hate the sharpest tool in the shed! Thank you! Right, she okay. was looking kind of dumb with a finger yeah, and Komodo a thumb. Joe. Should I play Komodo? Sure, let's do Komodo. Since he's probably the only one left. With the shape of an L on her forehead. It's not coming and they know I'm coming. And you said nobody knows the lyrics to that song. Let me let me fix that for you. Memers know the lyrics of that song. Really, you became a memer in like two months. <laughs> Become a memer with us. Become one of us. One of us. Oh no. One of us. So I uh, remember a while ago when I joked about this channel being a cult. <laughs> uh, what, what? I don't think it's a joke anymore. What cult? I don't know what you're talking about. Subscribe, like, and comment. Where else? Where else? I'll give you a TNT in Tiger Temple. Tiger Temple. Tigger. Titty. Titty Temple. Well, there goes any chance of ever monetizing this video. Ever. I, I already said fuck early. <laughs> Earlier. Uh. So, wouldn't have mattered. I'm trying to best to tune that out. Shite. Shoot. Poop. Home. 
It's really, like, specific, though. I'm pretty sure I could say hell, and I would get, like, it, it wouldn't be monetizable. Even though that's a word that, at most, is context-sensitive? Exa exactly, that's what I'm saying. Man, what's even the point of it telling me how many, like, boosts I get correctly in a row? Yeah, but it only counts up to three. It's, makes me sad. I, I like that they keep the counter, but I dislike that it only goes to three. I miss CNK already. Just kidding. All the CNK tracks in this game are like a million times better than they've ever looked. Not just because it's like a, just graphically, I mean just like artistically too. Oh, I was not paying attention to that. Oh god, okay. Okay, why has nobody hit this beaker? I'm pretty sure I put it there too. Yeah, that that's, uh, that's why. You're only making a trap for yourself. I need to just you have to go over this again. I just need to start putting them in places. Oh, there's the one you dropped. When like I need to start putting them in places where I guess I shouldn't expect them to go. The middle of the air, out where nobody drives. It's yeah, because trap. because I'm putting them where I would expect them to be. And then this happens. Bombs away! You can shoot a bowling bomb backwards by holding L downward and pressing square. I can read the shapes. Remember in Japan, fun fact, like I'm, I say this all the time, but I'm going to say it because why not? I'm going to try the shortcut every three laps, and, or every lap, and you can't stop me. That's in Japan, huh? Uh, okay. No, 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 I'm just saying that now. Also, I beat this Oxide Ghost without taking the shortcut once, and everybody I've told that to has been baffled, and I'm like, what? I just don't fucking trust the shortcut. I'm not taking it there. Um, anyways, in Japan, in the PlayStation, the X and circle are reversed. Yep. Because in Japan, the symbols are supposed to be attributed to what you would expect. Um... Like, the, the, the symbols all mean something. So... Yep, with the circle being yes and the X being no, but... The thing is, in the States, and for most of the Western world for that matter, we had already grown accustomed to the bottom button being jumped by then. Yep. Let's see, do you think I can... Fucking shit! Do you no. think I can get... I swear... I was about to say, I swear to God! <laughs> The answer is still no. Yeah, no. I think I need to have Sacred Fire to be able to do it. Like, at bare minimum. Heh, 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 heh. Bare minimum. Hey, I didn't hit that! You're not playing as a bear. Yeah, I was making a unbearable joke. <laughs> like, how did you know I, I was, like, how did you know I went to a bear park today? Which is not even a joke, by the way. That's what I was doing that I had to wait on. Were you with your brother? No. Oh, I thought you were watching your brother. That's why I figured you were going to be doing. No. What'd you do then? I went to a bear park on the other side of the state. Was it fun? Yeah. The, the drive there wasn't fun, though. It was only like an hour south of the Grand Canyon, so it was a pretty hefty drive. I've never been Arizona's to the a big Grand. state. I've never been to the Grand Canyon. Is it worth going there? Father Shitter. Father Shitter. Okay. Uh, I mean, it's about as worth it as you would think it is. Have you ever I wouldn't been... go there for it alone. Have you ever been I'd to find other things to do. I have not, but I want to go one day. Is it a good spot to go um, on your first date with a girl? To... Interesting question, and I don't have a good answer for you. Why not? Well, I mean, I've never been for one. Do you think the perfect crime would be to push somebody into the Grand Canyon? No, because there would be hundreds of witnesses. <laughs> yeah, but it's such a big canyon! <laughs> oh, no. 
I say that, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure there are many unsolved mysteries that relate to somebody being tossed in there. It's like I said, it's too big. It's not like it's not like every part of it is monitored. I want to go though. Well, I want to go, but I, at the same time, I don't because I feel like I'm not like fully scared of heights, mind you. But I'm like dececently scared of heights. I would. I don't say. feel like being scared of heights is actually going to bother someone God, too much. It. But I don't unless have, you're don't they have sky bridges where you can like stand on a bridge and you can look below you and you can see. They do, but honestly, you're probably better off not bothering with those because you're still going to have your fear of heights go off, most likely. It's, like, I don't know if I necessarily... Unless you're selectively scared of heights? Yeah, like, I don't know if it's, like, true sca I, I think a lot of it has to do with because I have an, a severe anxiety disorder and I think a lot of it just has to do with that. Like, I get anxious that, like, I'll fall off or something. Like, personally, the second time I went, which was the last time I went, I'd gone down a hiking trail, and I think that's probably a better way to go about it. Is there... I doubt it, but is there, like... Like, tours for inside there is. the canyon? Inside, no. I think the most you can get is a, a mule hike, but even that only goes so far, because, fucking as you have said, stage. it's a big canyon. Yeah, it's large. I fucking hate this stage, by the way. Absolute worst stage ever. Who even likes this stage? I do. Hello. Why? Because it's a fun stage. You're also, the I'm playing as Komodo Joe. That shouldn't even be legal to say. You're the person that would vote it in online mode. Yes, I am actually, because I've, I've done it almost every time. And then I would slap your hands and say no. And I would say yes. And then somebody else would vote yes. And then oh. you cry. No, there'll be Crash Cove there. No one's not gonna not vote Crash Cove. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> if Crash Cove is there, they're all voting for that. I, I don't know why. Like, what's the obsession with Crash Cove? First level of sorter, I guess. I guess there's also the the challenges right now in the Grand Prix, so that's probably oh, yeah, enticing that's even more people. part of it. People. But I guess it's more of like. How was it when the game came out? Whenever it popped up, did everybody vote it? I know a lot of people, everybody voted. I know Cocoa a lot of Park. people did. I don't think it was as bad as it was during the Grand Prix, though. Like, other stages, if they showed up, they still had a chance. I hate the Grand Prix. I hate the pit stop. I hate TNT! I mean, I didn't understand the first two at all, but TNT hatred is completely rational. <laughs> I hate PP! Well, now he has to declare his hatred for the other 25 letters. Uh. I hate QQ! I hate. <laughs> Chicken tenders. Yeah, that's just a lie. Uh. Who are you? What did you do with, with the picnic basket thief? Come on. What do you Make think I what do you think I go for first when I take those picnic baskets? Oh gosh, uh, I'm boo -boo. going so fast. I'm going so fast. You're, dude, if, if I'm Yogi Bear, you're the boo boo to, to, to my Yogi Bear. Am I wrong? No, not really. <laughs> That's what I thought. Now let's go take some picnic baskets. Woohoo! No, you're supposed to be like, I, I don't know, Yogi! <laughs> it's like the original Rick and Morty if you think about it. Oh my god, it all comes full circle. Just without the time travel or the science fiction. I mean, unless you count talking to the animals as science fiction, which uh, I guess. <laughs> we can make it a science fiction story. <laughs> it is now! From the year... No, 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 you know how to make it science fiction? Like way more make, fun you wanna know how to make the make uh, Yogi Bear science fiction? You, oh, you make time. it... You make every story one year ahead of whatever it is currently. Whoa. Isn't it sci-fi if it's in the future? Yeah. Exactly. You don't even have to make it a year. Make it 12 minutes after air date. <laughs> And then just like make it, you have to, you have to like write a story 
that is just like based like solely around um, it always being like a specific time ahead of whatever time it says you are in the world or whatever. So that way it's always in the, do that. That would make it sci-fi. Well, what if they were always right? Would they just be the new Simpsons? <laughs> I guess so. Who needs 15 seasons of The Simpsons when you got 89 seasons of Yogi Bear? Oh, hey, boo boo. <laughs> Did Yogi Bear. Was it ever like. Was it like a comic that was turned into a. Sh like, or like a comic strip or something turned into a show or was it like just always a show i feel like it was always a show but i can check for you why not who should i play who should i play oh yeah you don't have your cup um now we're really out of characters uh should, should i just go through the one wait i haven't done penta fine you get penta yes the day has come <laughs> But you gotta do the purple one so you can have fake crash for the last one. I have to what? But you gotta do the purple cup so we can use fake crash on the last one. Oh, is that is that the rule? Yeah. But doing purple is so weird. Like doing it fine, just this once. I mean it's gonna be the same video anyway. So. I have to do dragon mines again though! You were gonna have to drag in mines again no matter what. You're right. <laughs> and again for the time trial, th three times. Oh, oh, the time trial. Ugh. The time trial is gonna be terrible. It's, more, it's probably the hardest time trial in the game. Hardest Yogi Fox Bear on Wikipedia. Penta Yay One? Yay Penguin Yay One? Hit, hit me with it. Hit me with the Penguin Yay Ones. I love his cute little scarf. I've learned to... I don't know why, but I have an irrational fear for, um... What's it called? Surprising number of Yogi Bear video games. Yes, yes there are. <laughs> I have an irrational fear for, um... Any big Norm players I see. I don't know oh, why, but people who I play... See what I need to do now if we ever play online. People who play Big Norm seem to be really good at the game and it like intimidates me. I feel so much like I feel like I have worse turning than Dingo Dial. Maybe they maybe people do have different stats, I don't know. But they're both advanced characters. I know. He feels so much weird. Then again, maybe it's just because I went from Komodo Joe to him. Maybe. I don't know. Ah, he but said Komodo it! Komodo Joe has the same stats as Crash, theoretically. I'm pretty sure he said it. Penguin A1. The true... But there was a Yogi Bear comic line, but it didn't start till a year after the original TV episode. So... God, look at how cute Penta Penguin is. Penta Penguin's adorable. Also, so a little more trivia about Penta Penguin in the mm. Um, they did everything in their power to make him as originally broken as he possibly was, apparently. Because in the remake, in this game, apparently, just like in the original game, he swaps, like, left and right from having Aku Aku masks and Uka Uka masks. I've only ever seen him have Aku, but I wouldn't doubt it. Aku or Uka? Because I just had Uka. I've only ever gotten Aku. I, well, I got Uka on him, so that's even more proof. Oh, it's my favorite stage, Papu Pyramid. The stage that Papu himself did not think about. Wait, does... Does Kamara Joe have an egg on his head? Like, that's his outfit? He has an egg? No, what? That's the, like, Saudi outfit or whatever. The, it looks like an egg! Like the Arabian Knights outfit or whatever it is. I think I see it now. I, I still see an egg. I, I could see it. I could see what you mean in terms of the, what's it called? Like, the, the icon? But if you actually see yeah, it on his head, it's icon. not that puffy. Yep. 
Like, it, it looks like the egg when you put it on a child in Sonic Adventure games. Because <laughs> it's not covering the eyes. I am Blue Jay Pen Penta. So I guess I did play him at some point. Maybe it was during the, the Grand Prix stuff. The first part of the Grand Prix. Because I don't think I played him at all in the story. Because you would be the one to choose, and I don't think you've chosen Penta yet. Maybe? So, check for sure. One of the parts. Is, I want to say it's the last part. The, the part where you went through Tiny Arena in order to get the wheels. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, yeah, maybe I played Penta there. So that could have also been Dingadile, because Dingadile also we played as apparently and we didn't know. No, he still had. He had. He didn't have the one win skin. I think it was from a, one of the CTR things. Oh. Yeah. Was one of those skins. I'm pretty sure you let me play Penta on on that stage. It sounds like. Uh, no, you played as Grandpa Crash. Oh, uh, oh yeah, oh yeah. I forgot because I really wanted to play as Grandpa Crash. I was like, I want to play as him. But then that begs the question of where Penta's skin came from. Uh, is that is an unlockable. No, it's. I thought it's... all of Penta's were, except for one, all of them were for r winning races. Yeah, no, I the think last they're... one was for pit stop. I think they're all winning races except for Ninja Penta, because uh, oh my main save I <gasps> surprisingly enough I haven't used Penta once so so for all the begging you've done it amounts to nothing. Well, it's because the Grand Prix is screwing me over. Can you blame me? When the Grand Prix is like, I, okay, I, I have I to- I actually saw Kamada Joe there, and yeah, he, he doesn't look like he's wearing an egg on his model, just the icon looks like an egg. Yeah, it's just the icon. Which, by the way, I, if you guys weren't here for the last part, they did, in fact, I know we're kind of late in here, they did, in fact, update um, if you have a different icon depending on your skin. So, I guess Which people were asking for most of them are retailers, but I guess I'm happy that the ones that aren't retailers show up. Yeah, I think it's just to show off your swag even more, because that was one Basically. reason. Basically, that was one reason why they put the pedestals in the online mode. Cause oh, they put those in now. Yeah. They weren't there when I was playing through. They would just go straight to the lobby again. Yeah, no. It, it for the the Grand Prix update they added it so you can um, what's it called? So you can see there's a pedestal for the top three uh, winners, uh. which all have a vic, which are all doing their victory animation. Second and third place aren't crying. Interesting. You are interesting. You're, you have an interesting life. Bears. Uh, yeah. What were you doing? What were you doing at the bear park? If you don't mind elaborating. Some cute. We just. <laughs> Is this like a job going thing? On a whim. No, it's not a job. It was, it was a family meeting. We oh, just went on a whim. Okay. That was actually a pretty... You know what? I enjoyed Dragon Mines there because I didn't hit any of the walls. It was really nice because I, I, I got a small plush of a wolf and I've taken to calling him Wally. Penting A1? Penguin A1? <laughs> Alright, guys. You've probably heard this one before. Because we're playing Penta, I have to say it. <laughs> it's a poem. Roses are red. Violets are blue. Penguin yay one. Penguin yay two. Yay! For all the people that never played the original CTR, I feel like we have to explain it. Character was broken and he had his voice He clearly never finished. He, he wasn't finished. He was broken, like literally broken. Oh, I forgot to jump. That was awkward. Um, and he, they, they had one of the guys who was doing the voices. I guess they, they had placeholder lines where he says uh, "Penguin Ye One" and "Penguin Ye Two. Um, but they made it into the final product. So in the original CTR, you just hear a human voice saying "Penguin Ye One" and "Penguin Ye Two. Like, like the most bored sounding clips too. Well, they're placeholders. Well, I know they were never intended to be in the game, but <laughs> they were in the game. Oh, see, so, Aku mask. Yep. 
So I've gotten both an Aku mask and an Uka mask in this uh, cup. So for the further proof that they they try to keep him as broken as possible, like in the original. Yeah, I saw game. Aku rescuing you when you fell off too. Oh, I changed my. I pressed triangle on accident apparently. But yeah, so so yeah, he so it's just a it's just a running joke about the whole uh, penguin yay thing, and then they. They remade his voice line to say Penguin Ye One in this game. It's one of his lines. I've never heard that line from him in Nitro Field, but I almost never play Penta, so. Yeah, he, he does say it. I think it's for boosting certain boosts. Like if you get like a trick jump boost. I still have blue flame here, and it's kind of making me scared. Can I do this? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I flew off the edge. Never mind. <laughs> I could have kept oh, it. saving you this time. <laughs> See, guys, I told you, it's broken, but it's broken on purpose. They they just tried to make him as faithful to the original as possible, and I think they made him an advanced character just to be like, uh, remember he had a whole bunch of speed in the original mm -hmm. game. I think that was the the reference. I guess they did in terms of that, how they started him. Advanced was the closest to broken character they could have in an online game. Yeah, because obviously if he was truly broken, everybody would just use Penta. Which I, I'm like, I'm still saying they should have made him like broken in single player, because just just to keep up with the original ness okay, of it. Okay, but trophies. Well, then that just makes the. I mean, this game is pretty easy to platinum in my opinion. So there are some people that would love to fight with you over that. <laughs> I don't like what the hardest one. I think, in my opinion, the hardest platinum. Is and this should be the hardest platinum, it, or the hardest trophy rather, is all beating all oxide ghosts. But even then, I don't think they're that hard. Minus like dragon mines, and maybe like another few other ones that I can't think of offhand. Um, but like, what what else would be hard? I mean, the time trials. Just because you're ridiculously good at the game doesn't mean everybody is. No, that, that's what I'm saying. The oxide times. Cause that's hard. Like, I can't you, even beat entropy for most of them. Like you don't, you don't need the platinum relic, so that's out of the question. Otherwise, I would say yeah, it's hard just on that one alone. <laughs> but since you don't need the platinums, um, it doesn't really matter too much. And even if you did, you could just set to easy mode and you have more time. That's true. Yeah. Though some stages are p pitifully easy. Crash Cove in particular is really easy. You don't even need to hit them all. The what's it called? Oh, look at all these beautiful things. Well, do I even need to mention it? Fake crash. Okay, he is uh, balanced. I didn't know if he was balanced. For yeah, some reason, he's... I thought he was XO. Nah, he's normal. He's Just like, like the normal. actual crash. It's like actual crash. At least he's not <laughs> fucking <laughs> C and K fake crash. Or yeah, those. There's where, a word for those stats. Where, trash. where he's literally trash. <laughs> what was it? It was like two in every stat or something awful, right? I think it was one in one stat and two in another. I want to say, I don't think he had one in a stat. You want to bring it up real quick? I'm curious. I'm pretty sure, I want to say it was two. I know he had two turning and like no, two I... speed. <laughs> he might have had four XL, Maybe. But I feel like he had two across the board. Alright, I got the old tab up again. I have to scroll down a bit. Okay, first up, the CTR stats was 2 out of 6, 2 out of 4, and 3 out of 4, so standard intermediate. I found we already knew, but. Yep. Oh, here's fake crash for CMK. It's, it's two across the board. Yep. So it was either it was either that or he had slightly better XL. Yeah, he got he got gutted in that game. Yeah, just by comparison, uh, Neo Cortex, who is an intermediate, four four out of seven for top speed, five out of seven acceleration, three out of seven handling. So he has better in everything. Yep, he's literally the worst character in the game. It's yep. like it's like a joke, like a a joke character, except like. There's no reason to make him a joke character like that because he's already been in previous games as is. Not as a joke character. Like, 
you can well as a joke character but he's still functional sort of thing because like in the original ctr he is it's just like playing normal crash like you said just like he is in this game You want to know what my favorite quote in this game is from a character? Owee! Crash Bandicoot. It's 2019. I'm actually really happy that they kept like all of his original noises <laughs> that he makes. Also, um, I know you mentioned this I think like two parts ago I want to say about Velo, because we talked about his lines and you weren't sure how many that were kept. Yeah. Um, actually a fair amount were kept. Uh, oh god, chip one face crash the ceremony. Start your engine, I got another one. I'm that much closer to Tana. Um, but for example, um, he still has the line, um, don't the you know that I'm game. just toying with you? Which he says whenever you, like, drop an item or something. So he still has that line. Um, I, I want to say he still has Who's Your Daddy, but I'm not 100% sure. But he also has some new lines where he just, like, shit-talks his opponents. Which uh, makes sense for Vivo, given his character. Yeah, but does he have the most important line? Who's Your Daddy? I'm tall again! I... I want to say yes. Because I never heard that one. Though, I want I would say then. something here, but it involves, first of all, not confirmed stuff, and second of all, data mine content. Which I don't it's mind. not necessarily a problem. Do, well, do you mind if, I if we talk about them in videos at all? Should we, maybe we should save that for the next video. Because it would make more sense for the Grand Prix, because it's related all right, to Grand Prix fine. stuff. That's fine. Okay, we'll save for Grand Prix. We're getting towards the end of the video anyway. Yeah, that was another reason why I was thinking about it. Because I don't want to get into like a discussion about it, and then all of a sudden we have to kind of cut it off. Because we're at the way end. Uh, you're two tracks into this free, right? Uh, I think so. Uh, Dingo Canyon is first. I think this might be the second track, actually. Do I want to say Tiny Arena is usually the last track? Just mostly because it's a long stage, I suppose. Yeah, but we still haven't done Oxide Station, for example. Ah, uh, I forgot. That's... Yeah, that's probably... I think we're on stage two. Yeah, they put it in here, but they don't put it in the Arcade Cups for some reason. That's oh, yeah. Me. They put Slide Coliseum in there, but they didn't put Oxide Station. I was going to say, I think... Oh, oh, that's what they did? Oh, yeah. Is Oxide Station actually in this gem cup? In the gem cup, it's it's not in the, when you go to arcade mode and you select the cup. Oh, no, it's, it's not really, in there. It's really fucky. It's really. They took, but they put Side Coliseum in there. They also took Aqua Pump out of this the Nitro card stuff. That one I'm never gonna understand. I mean, I like Hyperspace. As a matter of fact, it's still probably one of my favorite. Oh, sure. it, it might be one of my favorite tracks in the entire game. Period. But. Um, there's but, yeah. other ways to go about it. Yeah, there is. Especially now that we have Twilight Tour. I thought they were gonna... Honestly, I, I, I guess I'll mention this in terms of, uh, what's it called? Um, Grand Prix stuff, because I'll probably forget about this. When, when they were doing Grand Prix, I thought they were gonna do... Like, I know they showed off the one stage, but I thought they were gonna do, a, like, a cup sort of thing. A like, lot they're... of people seem to have that misconception, but no, they never even alluded to that. I know, it's just, when I when I heard about the idea of the Grand Prix, I was like, oh, well, maybe they'll do, like, well, a it, It's just structure. a name. I know, and that, that sucks, though. I kind of wish they did four tracks instead. But, I guess... That might I be asking too much. too much. Maybe. I mean, I, I mentioned it in the last part, I do think Twilight Tour is pretty good. It feels kind of Mario Kart-y, but other than that, it's pretty good. Being a Mario Kart track isn't necessarily a bad thing, though. Oh, not at all. Mario Kart 8 has a lot of really good stages, so... There's just always, like, that one that slips through the cracks, I guess. But that goes for just about any kart racer. Like, for example, I don't like Dragon Mines. <laughs> I'm trying to think of but other I have my though. own tracks this game I don't like. Hot Air Skyway. So, uh... And I love Hot Air Skyway. 
In the original game, it was kind of like, eh, to me. But this game, I like it a lot. Especially because Blue Flame exists. Yeah, that was track two before. I'm actually curious. Um, I guess one thing that we can actually talk about for the rest of the part. I don't know, what, what are stages... What are stages from in this game specifically, right? That you like? Or We've already about, talked about this in the previous part. Have we really? Yes, we have. I, I know we've talked about favorite and least favorite. Yeah. But I'm thinking more of like, just generally like, what are stages that you don't like? Like, that are on your like, I just don't like these at all list. And then what are on your like, yeah, I like these more than the rest list. Because I know we've talked about favorite and least favorite before at the very least. So basically, top five and bottom five to so just. In a sense, yeah, it doesn't even have to be like five though, unless you want to make it five. But oh, yeah, yeah that, that was just an example number. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I'm kind of, I'm kind of curious because, like, for example, oh wow, how did I miss that? Um, I could say like, I really like uh, what's it called? Like, I could save some time to say that probably all of my top five would be in Nitro Kart, and I'm sure you're probably very similar. Uh, yeah, I would say so. I don't know if all five of them would be there, but... Yeah, not all five, but already? a good amount, yeah. Like, I can already think of, like, two... Often. I can already think of three. So, uh, what do you what do you better with naming? Like, the ones you dislike or the ones you like more? Usually it would be dislike, but in this case I think it probably should be like... Alright, what, what are they? Hit me with them. Okay, so, first one, Hyperspace which I cannot I believe I'm saying, but, look, it's a good stage now. It's all, I think it's always been a good stage, but whatever. <laughs> it, was, it was too long. I don't know. Okay, anyways, next. Well, it would be Thunderstruck, although the shortcut does kind of destroy it. The unintentional shortcut, mind you. Yeah, I mean, I only do that for grinding, otherwise I do it for legitimate way. Yeah, I don't really think that's the, the like level's it? fault is just... That was an oversight. <laughs> yeah, especially when it is absolutely getting patched one day. Yep. I'm pretty sure it's already taken out of the fucking online cycles as far as I'm aware, because I have not seen yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Alright, what else? That's two. I know you said three. The Electron Avenue. Okay, okay, okay. We have kind of similar ones. Oh my god, actually I think, funny enough, I think all of my favorites are... <laughs> Our, our, uh, CNK, come think of it. So, for CNK, Electron Avenue, because it's really good and really fun, um, and really fast. I'm just gonna fall off the edge here. Um, so I, I like that hyperspaceway, as I've already said. Um, me falling off Hot Air Skyway yet again. No. Uh, Tiny Temple, because that's just really fast, it's really fun to perfect. I just haven't um, played that level enough to really have an opinion on it. Okay. Um, and then I also really like Deep Sea Driving for the same reason. I haven't played a lot of that one either, but I feel like I have played enough of it that I can agree. Yeah, because it's, it's just really fast and it's really fun to perfect. That's that's why I like it. Um, and, and yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. What was the other one you said? I feel like I'd said four and I missed one. The uh, Hyperspace Way? I already said that, yeah. That, that that one's one of my favorites. I do like that one. Um, yeah, they're, they're all the really fast stages, come to think of it. <laughs> you just really like going like... fast. That's all there is to it. I do. It's fun. You know what's fun? Going fast. Fast as fuck. Wee. Um, yeah, no, I... What are your favorite CTR tracks, then? Oh, boy, that one's harder. Uh... Okay, how about this? What are your least favorite CNK tracks? <laughs> My least favorite would probably end up being the ones I just haven't played it as much of. Either because they're more similar to the originals, like Inferno Island, because you know there was no anti gravity there in the first place. I love anti gravity. It definitely works. It works when it wants to, which is like five percent, if that. My favorite. Yeah, I'm actually trying to th think through it. It's like my least favorite uh, for CNK is 
probably... I'm not really the biggest fan of Assembly Lane. Like, it's not bad. I Honestly, think. that was one I was thinking of, too. Like, And I do like the new shortcut they added. Yeah, so. it's like, it's not bad, I don't think. It's just, it's not really good either, is the problem. But a lot of the problems from the original stage... God damn it, there. shit! <laughs> God <laughs> shite, fuck poop. You censored yourself and you made it sound worse. No! Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> I need to send you a gif after after this. It'll it'll make you die inside probably. Or oh, laugh. It feels like I might have already seen this gif if it's related to the game. <laughs> okay, it's in Twilight Tour. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I felt. <laughs> It, remind, it eerily reminds me of the Daisy GIF when Mario Kart 8 came out. Do you remember that GIF? Except that one's debatably worse. I don't remember that one very well. So Daisy was about like to, early days Mario Kart 8. Daisy was about to finish her race in Mario Kart 8, and what ended up happening was she got hit by like three blue shells, like two red shells, like a green shell, like literally everything, yeah. and I think went, went from literally first to last. At the finish line of the last lap. Well, excuse me, that's just a normal game of Mario Kart 8. What, what do you expect? It's basically a normal game of CTR, for the most part. Kind of. Except this game's a little more skill expressive. Like, the people that are like, really good will be really far ahead. Oh, you ready to Shields go fast? Shields are actually reasonably easy to get in first place. You ready to go fast? No. Fast as fuck, boy! Oh, I lost my weak point, damn it. Well, that was the dream that died. I was ready to stack them both and go fast. Yeah, you could barely even stack one of them. Unfortunately. Wait, they just went through someone. Yes, yes it did. It went you through Poppy. Another day, Dingo Dial. No, oh, it is, it's Dingo, okay, never mind. I thought it was Papu. Nah. It's Papu his hat. Oh, oh, like yeah. Purple. Well, that's just bosses exclusively. Yeah. And whoever you're playing, obviously. I don't know, maybe you're playing as Oxide, so it's all bosses. <laughs> it's me, Nitrous Oxide, and I got the third place. Aku Aku. I wonder if he has a Velo mask. I feel like I've seen Velo masks on characters, but I'm not certain enough yes, to Yes, they, they are on characters. It, again, it was recently added with the Grand Prix. They, they okay, then, Velo yeah, mask. it would definitely... You would definitely have Velo mask. Like, you would assume he would have it, but you know, I know. Mean, he, he had it in CNK. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Fuck, this is so fast! Oh, God! Jesus Christ! <laughs> You can see me lose control of my speed. <laughs> Man, I had blue flame for that a long time there. My second lap is still the same. But then again, I had two. Whatever. All right, gem collector. Good job. Clap. Yay, you did it! I just did a crazy clap, and this guy over here is just giving me a golf clap. <laughs> Excuse me, I would clap way more enthusiastically for golfing. <laughs> hey, that's mean? <laughs> hey, you don't know anything about me. I l maybe I like golfing. I like golfing, actually. Golfing's fun. I know, I'm weird. I was actually gonna add. Actually, I really like golfing, so it doesn't yeah, even work. I used to do it every year, but I don't anymore. I don't even have my golf clubs anymore, unfortunately. I lost mine. Dude, that's what we need to do one day. We just need to go golfing together. Clearly. I yeah, I would do it up until high school. Then I lost them. It was like, oh, whatever. Oh, we unlocked Wasn't that the stage. Passionate. Turbo track. I have a love hate with that. Stage. Got to get out Probably of even more now. Oh, it's not Clancy. It's the j smooth jazz talker. Well, I'm pretty sure the guy that got for Uka in this game is the guy that voiced him in the Titans games, but I'm not certain. He's a smooth jazz guy. 
Alright, well, that is going to be the end of this part. Um, who do you want me to play as uh, for when I oh, do... Oh, man, that's a good question. When I do the 3 and 4 relics. is obviously going to be Oxide, but... Yeah, definitely. Well, at least for Oxide versus Oxide. I don't know if you want to yeah. necessarily play him. Like, in maybe not 3 4, because, like I was kind of alluding to at the beginning, we might just do a short part for that. Maybe. Um, so, who do you want me that to play when I go through these relics, though? The first relics. Good question. Let's say Ripperoo again. Because <laughs> we have to start looping characters at this point, unless you go to the pit stop. Have I done all the characters? Have I even played Coco? I have. Yes, you have. Cloud Engine. I have. I really have played as like I haven't played as Oxide yet, but I feel yeah, like we're saving him. I mean, yeah, I was about to say I feel like it's only safe to do the one character. I guess at the for the end of this part we can take a quick look at the pit stuff. I know most of it or all of it is actually uh, what's it called? Yeah, yeah it, it's all Grand Prix right now. <laughs> all Grand Prix stuff, but maybe you know by what? the end of the next video you'll have enough for a character and. Save real quick so it saves my actual character. Oh, he's laughing. He is going yes, crazy. Yes, I can hear him. I can't even hear the game, but I can hear him laughing. <laughs> I can't hear the game itself, but I, in fact, hear him laughing. I like how it auto saved right as I walked up to this for the record. Mm -hmm. um, all right. Oh, God, he was doing it again. Um, we'll see you guys <laughs> um, in the next part. You're jumping to stop him from spinning his <laughs> head. We'll do. We'll see you guys in the next part where we get to do World One and Two relics. Um, yeah. See you all then. Goodbye. Um, yeah, we'll see you all then. Uh, see you next semester. Have this nightmare fueled. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. We believe. In